All right, so we've got some drama that's been happening in the past couple of days. And I'm late to the party, as always, but not quite as late as usual. Uh, I think this only happened yesterday or the day before. But uh, the absolute piss stain of a human being that this world likes to call Jack Doherty or Doherty or however the fuck you pronounce that parasitic worm's last name uh, is in some more controversy. <laughs> what? Would you fucking know it? Uh, so if you haven't seen, and I'm sure you've clicked on this video, so you already know, and everybody who's everybody, you know, Charlie, XQC, uh, I think Asmund Gall, everyone, like, huge streamers have already like, spoke about it, so you've definitely seen, and it, I'm pretty sure it also made the news as well. He, uh, crashed his car when he was driving, because that fucking imbecile was on his phone. So, if you don't know the story, basically, he was streaming, okay? He was streaming, but he had somebody else holding the camera, holding, you know, the... You've got to point at him while he's fucking driving, because that's the most riveting thing ever. Um, and this absolute fucking piss stain decided to go on his phone. Uh, he kept checking his phone. I have no idea what for. I don't know if he was checking texts. I don't know if, you know, he had the chat on and he was looking at the chat, but I'm, I've never watched any of his streams. I've never watched any of his videos. I know who he is, and I've seen videos on him. I cannot... They like, physically stomach watching a single one of his videos that they're, they're all just the worst type of videos ever and I cannot stand him. The fact that he's made as much as he's made and has as much of an impact as he has on YouTube is is beyond me. It's always given to the worst people. And then people will complain and be like, oh my, I, how? How? Like, look at him. Like, he's, he's the worst. Anyways, let's go to the, he's got a new video up. Let's go watch the next video. And you know, they subscribe to him and they're wearing the freaking merch. I hate Jack Doherty with, you know, the he's selling. So the 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 supporting him in that way, you know, that's you know, that uh, he doesn't actually have a t-shirt or merch. I don't know if, I don't know if he has merch, but he definitely doesn't have a t-shirt that says I hate Jack on it. That would be fucking stupid. But you know, you get you get my point. People will actively hate him, but they will hate watch him, which inevitably gets him all of the stuff that they're jealous of him having because he doesn't deserve it. It's it's like a catch-22. It's like Ouroboros, you know, circling around, eating its own tail. It, it's ridiculous. But yeah, so basically, uh, I'll play a clip, uh, you know, strewn throughout the this little conversation that we're going to be having. But basically, yeah, uh, he was streaming on kick, and he kept checking his phone, and it was pissing down of rain outside. Literally, like, the, the rain's practically bouncing off the floor. From the looks of it on the video, it's, it's bad. And... Obviously, when you're driving on water at high speeds, things tend to get a little bit slippy. Oh! Oh! No! 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 Oh, fuck. No, watch out, watch oh. out. Oh. Now, it could be that. Then again, it could be the McLaren that he was driving gained sentience, looked at itself in the mirror and was like, holy shit, what the fuck is this paint job? I'm just going to take myself out because I don't know what he's done to that car. And McLaren it is such a nice car. I love them. It's not, not my go-to car. My go-to would be an Audi R8 if I could have any car. I love them. But um, a McLaren... Obviously, a really, really nice car, and he made it look like a fucking, like a toddler decided to to draw on it. Just like paint splats everywhere, which is on brand with Jack, really. Like, he's 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 just the worst. He picks the worst of everything. But anyways, um, he's driving and he ends up losing control of the car. So, in losing control, he skids from I think he's all the way in the left lane, and he skids all the way through and ends up crashing into the, the guardrail on the other side. And when I say he crashed, I mean he totaled that car. They pull the wreckage out and it shows you. The the, the entire front of the car, the, where the, where the air, like everything sits, is gone. It's like, it is a miracle. He's also, there's one point where he sat like on the video, because he streams this entire thing, by the way, and videos the entire thing. <laughs> you can't let content go to waste like that. Jesus, no. Um... Yeah, he he says, oh, if we were going, like, double the speed or something, yeah, I don't think we would have been here, dude. 
like talking to his friend who we'll get into that conversation in a minute but like dude you are very 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 goddamn lucky that you didn't die going the speed because i think it was about 40 miles an hour i think that's what he was going or kilometers now I, I have no idea what the unit of measurement that they use in america is but regardless he's it, it's 40 that's what the gauge is at i'm pretty sure when he smashed into the barrier that that's gonna do a lot of damage and jack seems to get away like sort of scot-free like he doesn't seem like he's got anything wrong with him whatsoever but his friend the one that had the video and the one that was recording the the stream and everything for him he's fucked up like he got he got knocked the fuck out basically he like, it, it turns the camera and you see him because jack takes the phone off of him you know film content you've 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 got oh no you you got you got blood in your face that's gonna be a great thumbnail quick pass pass it here pass it here let show everyone what's happening and he sh like, shows his face and dude i don't know where the cut was maybe it just looked worse than what it was but regardless he has blood gushing down his face and he jack could not give a flying fuck he basically gets the guy to double fist fucking phones to record from different angles he's like oh dude dude like keep recording and here they get this record on this as well so you can get like two different fucking angles on it holy shit holy fucking shit Oh, Michael, are you okay? Yeah. Holy fuck. Oh my God, bro. My whole... Bro, my whole fucking car, bro. No fucking way. Oh my gosh. There's no fucking... Michael, here. Michael, do you have your film on that phone too? If I was Jack's friend, whoever this guy is, I don't know if he's actually his friend or he just works for him, he's on his payroll or something, I have no idea. But if I was that guy, that would have that would have been it. I would have fucking cut ties with him, I would have beat the shit out of him, because he's almost killed you because he's not paying attention to the road, and he evidently doesn't give a shit about you. I think he asks him once, like half arsed as well, like, are you are you okay? And that's it. And then after that, he's like, here, here's the phone back. Keep recording. Here's another one. Record on that as well. You know, you got to get the content in. You got to get that views. I've just fucked my McLaren. This video is going to pay for the repairs of a brand new one. I, you, well, you're not really repairing that McLaren. It, that's total. That thing is is mashed. There's no <laughs> there's no real getting that back. It needs an entire new front. So, um, yeah, he, he, he couldn't care less. And for some reason, once they... Because I... I think uh, people came along to like help obviously get them out and stuff, but um, for, I, he has a weird, because every time I see clips of him, again, like, like I said, I don't watch his stuff, I can't stand the guy, but every time I watch clips of him, he always has his top off, and I don't know why, because he's built like a prepubescent child, I don't like, he, he has nothing to show, which is fine, like don't get me wrong, you you, you don't have to go out, you know, looking like a ripped muscle man like obviously that that's completely fine but i don't understand his incessive need to constantly take his top off in the most random times i don't think it was to be checked out from the ambulance because why i mean it was on the street bear in mind again it is pissing down the rain it is pouring down and he's, he takes his top off for no reason I, I can't imagine, you know, the ambulance driver or the, the doctors and whatever coming out, the paramedics, sorry, and being like, Jack, quick! Dude, take your top off. You go, come on. You're gonna die. Like, your hypothermia is gonna set in. You whip those clothes off real quick. I know that, that sounded backwards, I know, but... <laughs> but, um, but yeah, I, that's what I mean. Like, I just don't get it. I don't understand why he keeps taking his top off, but he did for some god-awful reason. Charlie put it best. I... Uh, I watched his video just before I made this one, and uh, I think he said he, he's built like <laughs> he built like a, a bag of milk. That's what he said. He's built like a bag of milk. Uh, pretty accurate. But I, I don't know why he he does it. Every video that I say, he's constantly got his top off. It's 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 fucking weird. But anyways, um, moving on towards the end of the video now, because not nothing else really happens. They sort of get they they get checked out. And luckily, his friend is fine, or his coworker, or whatever, is fine. Jack. But unfortunately, is fine. Um, but yeah, it, it's completely fucking reckless. And this dude, 
is probably going to get even more money and fame and infamy from videos like this that should really put you in jail because he filmed everything. The the paramedic like or the the police officer or whatever asks him like how did this happen like y y you've smashed into the guardrail here how and he was like I like I was just driving and you know I lost control of the car but don't get me wrong that can happen like in in situations like that, it's almost happened to me before when I was driving up Scotland and um, I was on the uh, in like a country lane country roads are dangerous as hell sixty miles an hour there's no lights. And they are slippy roads. So I was uh, basically went over like a lump and then it immediately just shot to the right. So I couldn't see, went down and then just had to quickly turn and my car like skidded. And it can happen to like, the best of drivers. It's called the hydroplaning when like you uh, sort of like, comes away from you. So that happened to him. And he's <laughs> again, like you can check this. It is, st I'm pretty sure it might be still up, but he is live streaming the whole thing. Of him being on his phone, being reckless behind the wheel, they can check that, and you can't hide it. It's on the internet. It's forever. There's people that have already took videos of that video, whether it got whether that stream got took down or not. There are people that have the evidence there in their own YouTube videos of you on your phone in the car behind the wheel, right when it fucking you know when everything went south. So you, you can't lie, and I know why he lied because he's not going to be like. Well, you know, I was on the phone. I'm going to do the right thing. You know, I, I, it's my fault. No, he's going to lie his ass off until hopefully something gets done about it. And uh, he has also been banned on kick as well, which is a Herculean feat, to be honest with you. Like to get banned off of kick, like that's um, that's a goddamn miracle. I don't know if it's a permanent ban. I don't know if he's actually being like banned for life or if he's just getting banned, you know, for a week, a month, a day. I have no idea, but he obviously brings in a lot of money for kick. I, I, I don't imagine it would be permanent forever, but yeah, regardless, he's he's as of right now, uh, been been banned. So fucking good. The that little scumbag, that little parasitic worm, deserved nothing but the worst in life. But yeah, uh, <laughs> I just wanted to talk about this because, like I said, I saw it in my. It boils my blood. It boils my blood that there are people out there that are like struggling working a job that they hate, working two jobs that they hate, just to make ends meet. And then there's this guy who does nothing but make other people's lives a misery and then cause actual genuine danger and danger in the lives of not only himself and the person that was in the car with him, but other people on the road as well. And no doubt he will probably make or find a way to make money off of this and make even more money and buy more luxurious stuff, a nicer house, a nicer car, more jewelry, whatever the hell he wants and it'll it'll probably just help him in the long run and the thought of that is just fucking disgusting it really is his world is completely screwed but yes um enough of my ramble i just want to like i said i just want to talk about it because i i fucking i hate that guy and i've had no reason to talk about him because i have no reason to want to ever watch his videos but this one boiled my blood and i just wanted to rant about it a little bit so uh, yeah if you enjoyed please leave a like comment and subscribe it does help massively and i do massively appreciate it and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.